Farmers we spoke with today say they feel like they're becoming targets. Crews have been cleaning up one of the barn fires all day. Right now they're doing a controlled burn to get rid of some of the extra debris at this site. The man who owns this property says this fire cost him about $300,000 worth of damage. An eerie scene. Smoky debris left over from a devastating barn fire. $300,000 worth of damage and 27 cows killed. There's no stopping it. Whenever it takes off, I mean, it goes extremely fast. Farmer and property owner Baron Kiefer was here when the large barn on his Quarry Road farm went up in flames Tuesday. Just to give you an idea of how bad this fire was, look at how the destruction extends all the way over here. And there's still this haze of smoke coming out from the fire and the smell still so strong. Pretty sad, pretty upset, pretty empty. We went all day yesterday and now we're on another day of just just going. Also Tuesday, a welding business nearby burned, plus a barn fire Monday and one today, all in Franklin County. And today's fire was another one of Baron Kiefer's properties. Baron's mother was there. I don't even know how to explain it. It was just, I don't think I've ever experienced anything like that in my life. No cause from the fire marshal, but farmers asking lots of questions, like why it appears they're being targeted. I've never seen it in my life. I, it just, it's just, I don't know. I don't understand why people would do that to other people's livelihood. Not only did Baron Kiefer lose the 27 cows in this fire, he also had more than a dozen cows stolen from him in August. A rough couple of months for this family here. Meanwhile, the fire marshal is still investigating this fire and the several other fires that have happened here in Franklin County. In Franklin County, Lara Greenberg, CBS 21 News.